What is a pop a in YouTubers? Rifle Gaming here, bringing you a guide for Dragon Priest Mass. This is where Croesus would be at, but I've already killed him. If you'd like to know how to kill him or, or what's he like, click on the link in the description. Yeah, I put in an archery weapon guide. I didn't realize like how important these masks were, and I just put it into another guide. Alright, now here's where the water-breathing mask called Vulgar is at. It's up at Valskige. Valskige isn't just going to be no walk in the park. There's tons of traps. There's a puzzle, which I will demonstrate how to do, though. There's tons of enemies. Let's just put it this way. It's a big nipple twister. Alright, now once you enter this jigsaw, you'll come across a couple bandits here and there. Going deeper inside the dungeon, though, you'll find this puzzle. And here's the combination to the puzzle. It is snake, bear, fox, wolf. It's pretty simple. Snake, bear, fox, wolf. Snake, bear, fox, wolf. Snake, bear, fox, wolf. Snake, big, fox, 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 fox. You get the picture, though. Remember that combination. Once you enter the combination, the gate then opens. And then you travel more deeper down inside the Sharitha. Once traveling down deeper inside the Sharitha, you will come across a lever. You then pull the lever, and a gate opens, and then all of a sudden, this powerful skeleton starts chasing after you. He has these glowing big blue balls as eyes balls, and a powerful companion that's shaped like a penis. Quite the combination. But they're no match for my giant testosterones. Okay, you will then enter a room with trap floors. The first one doesn't activate, but the second one will. So watch out, do not step across that trap floor, because you can fall to a bottomless pit of ass. Alright, once you get deeper inside this dungeon, you will then be realizing how much you're running like a crazed black man from the KKK. Or vice versa. The more deeper you get, the more stronger the enemies are going to be. Spiders, dead guys, etc, etc. Please pack your lunch, because you're going to need it. Come prepared, down here, for dear sake of the wolf man. I don't know what that means, but that sounded pretty stupid. So, back to the topic. You need to know what's going on through your life by the time you get to high school. No, wait, that's not the, that's not the topic. Um... You know, I actually forget what the topic was. But here's a nice amulet that I found from a restless dragon. I don't know if it's luck or that guy always carries it, but 10% prices. Once you reach the dragon overlord, you will then realize how hard this is going to become. Because this guy is a pain, big pain, in the middle of your ass cheeks. Like, really, the whole time I was in a battle with this guy, I felt constipated. And there was sweat dripping down my skin. My mom then walked in on me and said, Brian, you look sick. By the way, that's my name. And I was all like, Mom, I'm not sick. She was like, Brian, why is your eye squinted? And you're like, squinching up. I was like, Mom, I'm, I'm just, I have to shit. My mom then looked at the game and looked back at me. And was like, Brian, I'm going to go bake you some cookies. I was like, okay, Mom, thanks. I never did see those daggone cookies. That was just an excuse to get away from me. Because at the time I was talking to her, I actually pooped myself. Dear God, was that a problem? Now, that you got to the top, you'll be fighting Volgar, the Dragon Priest. The guy that gives you the water-breathing mask. The moment I've always been waiting for. As soon as I got to him, though, I had to pause it at the time. My dog was choking. I ran up to my dog and I just stuck my index finger right up his Uranus. And he just yelped. He yelped, and I let him free. I let him free. That's the only way you can save a choking dog. Just stick your index finger. Get your index finger. And jam that sucker right in their butthole. I really had no idea why I'm telling you guys this story. The story is actually very personal. It's, it's crazy things that happen while you're playing the Elder Scrolls Skyrim. It's, it's honestly just insane. Like this one time, I was... I was fighting this dragon, and all of a sudden, I, I heard something. I got up, and I checked who it was. It was this, it was this, it was this, like, weird-looking guy standing at my window. I opened my window up, and I was like, who are you, dude? 
he was all like, I have came for your soul. I was like, what? My soul? He was like, yeah. I then took my two fingers. I stuck it in his eyeballs. And he ran like a little bitch. He ran. Alright, I'm done raining on about my life that has happened ever since I've gotten Skyrim. To kill Vulgar, all you really need to do is just keep shooting him down the mountain and dodging his attacks. I just made it sound harder than it seems at the beginning. It really wasn't that hard. Remember to subscribe, rate, and comment for more videos like these. In Transmission. Rifle Gaming out.